When we think about the word poema, poema is a Greek word that means the works of the creator. In the, the New Testament, we find in the New Testament that word mentioned twice in Romans chapter 1 verse 20 and Ephesians chapter 2 verse 10. In the first passage in Romans, it talks about the creation, how the creation reveals and points to God's eternal power. It points to an existent God. The second passage says that we have been created in Christ Jesus so that we may walk in those good works that he prepared beforehand. So the first passage talks about the creation speaking and pointing towards God. And the second passage points, talks about we are his creation, his workmanship. Poema. Poema is an expression of God's glory. The word poema is also the root for the word poem, which is a beautiful expression combining Rhythm and rhyme and using descriptive language in an artistic uh, utterance, which is used to declare the glory of God. So tonight's celebration of the arts has been an expression of God's glory. Do you know the glory of God? Have you seen the glory of God? You see, 2 Corinthians chapter 4, 6, which is a, very, is a passage very close to my heart. It says that the knowledge of the glory of God is only feasible, possible, through the face of Jesus Christ. There is a way to know God in his most glorious form, and it's through the person of Christ Jesus. Do you know Christ Jesus? Do you have a relationship with God? Because poema points to God, the, cre the creation points to an existent God. We are the workmanship of God to declare his glory. But when you have a relationship with a living God, you see, you can partake of his, the, your sin have been forgiven. You have a personal, you can enter into a relationship with God because sin separates us from God. And I don't know if anyone here, any of your, any family, relatives, friends, guests have never heard, probably you have never heard these words before. But that's the mission of South Lake Christian Academy. That's the mission of the fine arts department to declare the glory of God through the expressive arts so that we may Make much of Jesus and worship him. If you have a personal relationship with God, now you can be, like, like Paul says in 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 2, we are living letters, living epistles that declares, that shines in the world of darkness. That is only possible through the person of Christ Jesus. Hola, qué bueno que nos estás viendo. Suscríbete a nuestro canal de Pepe Bass Jr. oprimiendo el botón rojo para suscribirse y recibir avisos cada vez que subamos videos. Y no olvides de compartir este canal y videos con tus familiares y amigos.